Hello, I'm Sean Roberts, Chief Technologist for Lincoln Network, and this is Lincoln Shorts. Earlier today, I had the opportunity to speak with Kim Wyman, Washington Secretary of State, and this is our conversation. If I registered absentee, um, well, if I was registered absentee, um, and I decided, to, and I had already sent in my ballot via USPS, or um, let's say through the post office, and I had a concern uh, that it, it uh, wasn't going to get counted for a variety of reasons. Um, I think some you already outlined. Um, and, and I wanted to go and vote in person to uh, be sure that my vote counted. What would be the proper procedure as a voter to, um, if, I, if I had that concern? Well, here in Washington State, my first recommendation would be to go to votewa.gov and to pull up your individual voting record. And you'll be able to see, first and foremost, if the county election officials have received your ballot and whether or not it's ready to be counted or if it's being held because it's challenged. Um, then if it gets to be election day and you can't get that information and maybe you've called the election offices, another suggestion is call them straight away and uh, and just ask if, if they've received your ballot and verify it. If you can't get that confirmation and you decide to go to a voting center on election day, you're going to just uh, need to maybe stand in line. And uh, and these centers are going to be open for the entire voting period. So don't wait till election day. But mm -hmm. you can go in in person. You can have a new ballot or a replacement ballot uh, issued, and that will cancel your first ballot. And then they'll issue you an another ballot to uh, to be counted. But, uh, but realize that uh, if you've already returned one, you might want to let election officials know that because you're concerned that they haven't received received it because you don't want to be accused of um, trying to vote twice or, or perpetrating any voter fraud because it is a felony. Yes. Felonies are bad. I think we, felonies everyone can agree on that. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> so definitely the, the, the correct process, if, if you have any concerns of whether or not it was um, already received, um, check online or check with elections officials and tell them, uh, explain to them your concerns rather than just assuming that they'd figure it out. And uh, communication being the key here, of uh, so that you don't take the the uh, the worst possible case scenario, which is voting twice, which is a felony. Thank you for joining us. This has been Lincoln Shorts.